Uh, hey, yeah, it's up gamers. Welcome back to another video. It's me, Lilts with Tower, and this is Tower Vlog 9. Um, today I'm going to be talking to you guys about what my life has been like so far. Um, currently I'm feeling quite sad and I'm currently grieving because my, my GHD broke. It had the red light of death. That made me feel so sad, but luckily I immediately told my mother and she brought me back a new GHD that we had in our garage and it works perfectly and as you can see my hair, it looks so pretty right now and I'm so happy because today, I mean tomorrow, that means that I can go to school with pretty looking hair. Um, also I think that my hair is growing longer, do you guys see that? It's like, it feels long. Um, but yeah, I'm happy that my hair can look good at school from now on because today at school my hair looked horrible um but a lot of people were giving me compliments on it because you see like we had swimming right now you see i'm not that big of a fan of swimming um luckily my pe teacher is aware of that and because she's so lovely she did everything she could to make sure that my hair didn't get wet but today it got wet and it was all wet and my fringe was so gaffy and 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 it was all just shriveled up because you know my hair it's naturally it's usually quite curly and so like like when my hair straightened it's down to here right but when it's curly it's like here shrinkage is real guys um you know and it's so like for the entire day my hair it was like up, it, it was like down to there and it was all curly and my bangs were all messed up and they were so gappy and I was so upset um worst part was that I met like a bunch of people and well I mean yeah they did tell me that I had really cool looking hair but still I didn't feel like it was cool and a lot of people still wanted to touch my hair because they said they looked fluffy and cool and poofy but I didn't think they looked cool fluffy and poofy it was greasy because I haven't washed it I hadn't had washed it in a while and and it was it was wet and soggy and I felt like roast chicken and then I got a paper cut on my finger can you guys see um so that made me feel so sad but today for breakfast the good thing was I had scrambled egg egg specifically I only had one egg that was scrambled and then I had a cappuccino and that was like really really yummy and I really like that and then after school I, I was so happy because um my mom and I, we bought some Monster Energy. I got a can of Ultraviolet. Ultraviolet is one of my favorite. It tastes like table grapes. And table grapes remind me of my nan. And 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 then I got a Kinder Surprise and it was it was yummy. And I, I got a cool toy. It was some kangaroo looking thing. Um and then we went thrifting. Oh yeah, and I, I another story related to the thrifting. So you see Today, randomly, arbitrarily, I decided to, to take a green pen to school today. No reason whatsoever, I just wanted to take a green pen. Later on during the day, my lovely friend Cass, she's like on my best friends, like I met her um, a few weeks ago. Um, we were, we were um, doing something, but anyways, it got to the point where she gave me two dollars and I was just like, oh my god, thank you so much, because I love money. Um, in return, I gave her the green pen so that I would not feel guilty about taking the two dollars. And I mean, two dollars—it's—it's it's not that much amount of that. That's not that much. It's not that much amount of money. It's not that much. That's not that much money. So, um, like, what well, you can't really buy a can of monster energy with that. You know what I mean? Um, so we both probably thought nothing of it. Um, considering that it was just like two dollars, right? skip to the end of school I had the two dollars in my pocket and my mom took me thrifting and like we, we were looking around I didn't really see anything that caught my eye so we were right about to walk out right but then I saw one of the coolest shirts I'd ever seen ever <laughs> I saw it and I was just like, OMG, I need this. This is perfect. Um, and so we quickly went up to the counter and I purchased it. And guess how much money it was? Two dollars. That's right. Um, luckily, I still had the two dollars in my pocket. So I pulled it out and I, I, I bought it for two dollars. And that was one of my like greatest investments ever. I'm so happy I, I bring that green pen to school. Um, Moral of the story is that small arbitrary decisions can, in fact, 
determine your success in life. Although you will not know the outcomes. Make that into a t-shirt. And today it was also really fun because, because you see, my timetable, it was falling to part. But luckily I told my favorite teacher, Mr. Ladder, about it. And he, he printed me off a new one. Well, it wasn't just one new one. It was actually two ones. So now I have two schedules. And I'm so happy. Also, guys, I know that I shared this in my community page, but also, Mr. Latter, he likes Marilyn Manson, and I'm pretty sure The Beautiful People is one of his top five songs on Spotify Wrapped, and that is so cool. He's my favorite teacher. And and he, 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 let, he lets me listen to music in class. By the way, gamers, if you need any more song recommendations, I would recommend... Hmm... Angel Eyes by New Year's Day featuring Chris Motionless. I really, really, really like that song. It's one of my favorites right now. And also Apple of Sodom by Marilyn Manson. That's also another one of my favorite songs right now. It's really, really, really good. And yeah, by the way, gamers, do you like my eyeliner that I did today? Isn't it so pretty? Wait, here. Like, can you, can you guys see that? Um, anyways, I don't really have anything else to say, so make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you get all the latest updates. Thank you all so much for 2.75k subscribers. Um, bye!